pop and yeah. I got some new wigs. I got my new wigs in the mail. So we're gonna try those out today. I'm so excited. I haven't gotten any new wigs in a long time, so this is gonna be great. But we'll try those on when my makeup's done because I feel like it would look weird putting wigs on when my makeup isn't done yet. If you're hopping on, say hello. I am so tired today. I am just, I need a nap today is what needs to happen. The girl needs a nap. Or maybe two naps. I don't know. Um, I'll put my jewelry on. Hi, Patty. Hi, Deborah. Hi, Stacy. What's poppin'? I think we'll do my Dior earrings today. I got this crazy antenna. Like, look at this. What is that? We've got good reception today. <laughs> um, extra reception. Oh my gosh, I can't even put this in my ear. Okay, there we go. All right. Oh, yes, bougie earrings, we like that. Oh, back from Mexico. How was your Mexico trip? What's poppin'? I think we're gonna do a warm toned makeup look, but um, I forgot what I was gonna say. I might add some color with the warm. I did, I might, did I do green? I think I'll do green this time. I don't think I did green last time. So we're gonna use my custom palette that I made, but we're gonna add green with it. You like my shirt? Thank you. I got this from the Corvette Museum in Kentucky. Aren't they cute? These earrings are from Lavish. Hashtag Lavish if you want a link. Um, what was I gonna say? I was just gonna say something and I completely forgot. What were we talking about? Mm, Corvette Museum. Oh, I was gonna ask you guys, do you know any good websites to just buy like regular, plain, nice fitting, long sleeve shirts? Because all I have is sweatshirts. Like this is technically a sweatshirt because it's got a little hoodie on it, but I'm trying not to wear sweatshirts as much. So I just need like nice, regular, long sleeve shirts, but they need to actually like fit nice. That's the problem whenever I try to find stuff that fits. Like hoodies are supposed to be baggy, so that's fine. But like a long sleeve, I want to like fit me a little bit better. Like this doesn't even fit me, but I pretty much just bought this because it was blue and I liked the blue color. Thank you. I have a low key, a sore throat today. And I don't know if you guys ever saw these before. They are called Slipper, it's Slippery Elm but they're like these little, um, I don't know what you wanna call them, little tablets, you just you just suck on them. But they're good for coating your throat if you have a sore throat. I don't know if I actually have a sore throat or if I just scratched my throat this morning because I didn't wake up with a sore throat, but I got one after I ate. So I feel like I accidentally like scratched the back of my throat somehow, I don't know. We need greens today because I need energy, so. This always gives me energy. You haven't seen me live in years. Girl, where you been? I've been here this whole time. I uh, never stopped showing up. I've been here. I've been doing lives for a long time now, like seven years. What's poppin'? Did you see the new brown Louis Vuitton ring that are for sale under lavish? The only problem is they are the adjustable ones. Oh, I didn't see that. I can't look because I'm on um I'm on I'm on my I'm live on TikTok too. Greens for the win. This has um wheatgrass, it has spirulina in it, and then it has a bunch of greens. I like how this is in a Budweiser glass. Um, it's not, there's no alcohol in here, but, um, this is basically all your greens. So it's got a lot of vitamins and minerals in here. If you don't eat a lot of vegetables, this is kind of like a little supplement 
or vegetables, but you should still eat your vegetables. Don't skip out on veggies. Uh, we're gonna use this palette. My custom palette that I made this one. Hi, Gabriella. I've got greens and then lots of nudes, so I think we should use these two colors, the ones on the end. We ever do those crazy makeup lives again? Probably not. Mexico's been fantastic. You probably have such a nice tan right now. You probably have such a nice little tan. What am I doing? I'm so lost right now what I was just going to do. I'm trying to eat this real quick so I'm not talking with food in my mouth because that's kind of annoying. All right. We need to put my moisturizer on first. So I'm going to do the blue mask. Love this stuff. Um, hi, Sharon. What's popping? I started using Vital Protein Collagen. It's so clean and since watching my sugar, it's been... It's the best. You can tell a difference. That's awesome. Yeah. Protein and collagen, really helpful. Did you know that actually too, like if you're trying to lose weight, you want to consume more protein? A lot of people don't know that. They just think like, oh, I got to stop eating all this food. But you basically just want to eat whole foods, but you want to consume more protein. But yeah, collagen does wonders. My hair grows really fast with collagen. All right, I do a little extra on my lips for this blue mask. Hi, Nicole. Does anybody here have wigs? I'm curious. Does anybody here wear wigs? I love wigs. I don't wear them that much, but I love them because if I ever get a little bug, bug up my bum or whatever, what's the phrase? It's not even that. Um, what's the phrase? Uh, I can't think, but it's something else. Oh, I can't think of it. <laughs> but you know, when you get that little thing where you want to change your hair color, itch, the itch. Yeah, it's like, like a, there's a phrase for it. I can't think of what. Um, whenever I get the itch to like change my hair, I just like wigs because... I don't like to put my hair through all that damage. Wild hair, thank you. There's one phrase, there's another one. Scratch an itch or there's another one that's with a bum, but I don't remember what it is. <laughs> um, <laughs> hair up my ass. Oh my gosh, I don't know. Um, yeah, I just like wigs because you literally can, like if you, for some reason, like lately, I love the, the red hair for some reason. I think it's kind of trending right now, but I love the look of red hair. But I don't want to traumatize my hair to make it red. And then I don't know if I'll like it. Cause I'm the type of person that every time I try to do something new with my hair, I want to go back to blonde. So I really like to do wigs because you literally can pop it on and then you can take it off just like eyelashes. Like, I don't like to be fully committed. I want to have my natural lashes. So I like the magnetic ones because I can put them on and I can take them off. Just like makeup, I can put it on and I can take it off. It's so nice. All right. I'm taking my probiotic too, just in case I am getting sick. I take this every day anyways, but I'm taking it early today. Because if I am getting a sore throat, I want to knock it out right now. Um, so I just put two moisturizers on. Your husband does not like red hair. Cheers. This is my little probiotic. It's just, uh, it's like a pixie stick. It's like a powder and it dissolves in your mouth and it tastes like peach. All right. Yeah, I just use, I use these two. This is a night or no, this is just a regular thick moisturizer. This is an overnight moisturizing mask, but you can put this on anytime during the day and it works really, really good. I'm actually gonna put more. I like to do a couple layers on my lips because my lips are always super dry. So by the time we do my, my lip makeup, my lips are nice and plump. And it kind of exfoliates them too. If you have a lot of dry skin on top, it'll make the dry skin come off. 
Um, okay, so we're using luminizing, luminizing, lum, lum, see, I can't even talk. You can tell I'm tired when I can't talk. Luminating primer. Okay. And then medium BB cream. You're a redhead, but more strawberry blonde. Um, we're going to get the moisturizer. The moisturizer should be pinned right here. There's supposed to be a link pinned right there, but I don't see it. But there should be one. Do you guys see a link pinned right there? Beauty by Hannah Lee. That's where you can find the moisturizer. And it's linked in my bio if you're on TikTok. Um, okay. BB cream. So I do... That's like a pump right there. This is like... It's like empty. Empty. Okay. That should be good enough. And then illuminating. You see it? Okay. Yeah. There should be a link pinned right there. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, it was kind of funny today. So I had my car parked outside last night and um, sometimes if it's a little chilly out when my husband leaves, he'll pull my car in the garage before he goes to work. When he pulls his truck out, he puts my car where his truck was. And this morning, <laughs> I didn't know he did that. So this morning, well, part of the reason why I didn't sleep well is because I went to bed late but then also I got woken up really early uh because I woke up when my husband got up to go to work so he gets up at like six o'clock I think so that really messed me up so I was just like super tired today and then um I went outside to go leave to go to the gym and I like just stop I'm like Oh, where is my car? It's gone. Where, why is my car gone? Where is it? So I just like standing there for a blank second. And then I'm like, oh, Tyler must have pulled my car in the garage. So then I walked back in the house, locked the door, well, walked in the, walked in the garage and there it was. I was like, oh, geez. Okay. <laughs> my husband said he was watching me on the camera. He's like, you looked like you were shocked. Like somebody stole your car. I was like, yeah, I'm really out of it today. I know I need to take a nap, but no time to take a nap today. Maybe later. Yeah, Beauty by Hanley. Thank you, Deborah. I'm gonna. I should pin it because I don't know why it's not pinned. It's supposed to be pinned to the link. This is the link right here. But yeah, I just mix those two products together and it just has the most beautiful finish. Pin. All right, there we go. But yeah, the struggle is is real today on Monday. Is anybody else tired or is it just me? It's partly my fault. I should have went to bed early. I do this every sun. Well, yeah, I do that every Sunday. I'm like, I'm gonna go to bed early so I'll have a good start to my Monday. And that never happens. I always go to bed late and then I'm tired on Monday. Embarrassing. <sighs> Give me some energy. Give me energy. You better fix me. Is that what people say? It's like the little meme. You better fix me. I'm gonna zoom in because I'm really far away. Ooh, gosh, my eyes look so blue right now. Ooh, did you see that? I just smucked my teeth with this. This is glass. I've never heard of that brand. Leah brand? You woke up sick. Oh my gosh. I know, I feel like I'm getting sick. I hope not. A lot of people are sick right now. I probably, to be honest, I probably should have just skipped the gym today. Because I didn't have really any energy to be there anyways. But I try to be consistent even when I don't feel like going there. My husband gets up at 4.15 and I get up to pack his lunch and make him a quick breakfast and make all his coffee before he leaves. That's so sweet of you to do that. So nice. We try to do, my husband doesn't, I don't think he even eats breakfast. Like he kind of, he fasts, but not like, um, he doesn't do it intentionally. He just doesn't really eat breakfast. So, um, my husband does have coffee though, but he doesn't, we try to do the, like the home, co home coffee thing and he's just not a home coffee person. He said it just doesn't taste the same. But that's because he gets Dunkin' Donuts. 
who here, I'm curious, are you a Dunkin' Donuts fan or are you a Starbucks fan? Leave a comment, let me know. No, this is a birthmark. I don't have psoriasis. It's a birthmark. Duncan! Duncan! Okay, I'm seeing more Duncans. Duncan? My husband loves Dunkin' Donuts. So he's a, he goes there, that's where he gets his coffee from. He doesn't, I even bought him like the Dunkin' Donuts coffee to make his own and he never used it. So he just likes his little routine of going to Dunkin' Donuts in the morning. Dunkin' Donuts, Starbucks, I don't drink coffee. Dunkin' for sure, Dunkin', Dunkin', Starbucks all the way. Krispy Kreme, we don't even have Krispy Kreme here anymore. I make mine at home. Dunkin' Donuts, wow, I'm surprised. I thought for sure there's gonna be more Starbucks people on here. But Dunkin' Donuts, isn't Dunkin' Donuts like half the price of Starbucks? Dunkin' Donuts is pretty freaking good. When I used to be able to tolerate um, Dunkin' Donuts, I would get a, I would get a deca decaf coffee. I still, I can't even do de decaf now, but I would get a decaf, um, latte with almond milk and I would get sugar-free syrup, but I would only get like a tiny, tiny, tiny bit. And I think that's all I would get from Dunkin' Donuts and it was really good. I miss it. I miss it. I don't remember what my husband gets. He get, His has so much sugar in it though. I don't know how he drinks. I think it's just like when you're used to eating that much sugar, it's like normal for you. But when you don't eat a lot of sugar, I just can't. His thing just tastes like pure sugar. He gets like a iced vanilla swirl or something with extra sugar and cream or something. If I had to guess, I think that's what he gets. It's too sweet for me. Ooh, okay, I just used a lighter color in the BB cream for under the eyes. But it's half the price, but coffee flavor is way different. It is a lot different, isn't it? I don't, I've had Starbucks coffee too. I actually like the richer flavor of Starbucks coffee, but Starbucks coffee completely whacks me out. Like, I don't know if they put crack in their coffee or what the deal is, but it like makes me crazy, literally. Thank you. I do, yes, I do, Bridget. Um, I get like, I just cannot have caffeine. Like my body cannot tolerate caffeine. Caffeine gives me anxiety i don't have anxiety but i get anxiety when i get cough when i drink coffee um i get like i get snippy like i get moody it's like all this weird stuff that i don't usually have issues with i get snippy i get anxious i get um the worst those aren't that's not even the worst part the worst part is that i can't focus at all if I drink any, yeah, it's like crack. If I drink any coffee, like I cannot focus to save my life. So my whole day is shot, completely shot. The last few times I tried to drink coffee again, I was literally sitting on the couch for hours because I couldn't do anything. It was like so weird. It's like paralyzing, <laughs> not in a good way. Oh yeah, this is bad. Like I got the jitters, I got the shakes, can't focus. Just like, oh my gosh, it's, it's horrible. It sucks. I love the way coffee tastes. I love the way it smells. Wow, TikTok's on something else lately. It just yelled at me and said that my video may contain things that are not suitable for kids. Okay, what is, maybe because I said crap. We're not talking about real crack. We're talking about Starbucks. Yeah. Um, yeah. Apparently TikTok did not like that word. Heart palpitations, panic attacks. Yeah, same thing, Jill. Same thing, girl. Yeah, it's, it's just not. Some people just cannot have caffeine. I don't know where my other contour stick is. This one is not very dark though. 
it'll do for now. It'll do for now. Thank you for the heart, Dee. Thank you, thank you. Hi, Michelle. But yeah. So I have to survive without caffeine. I can, um, I can literally can't even, there's like hardly anything I can even have at Starbucks. And like, I don't really like to buy sugary drinks of any kind. Can you drink decaf? I can't really, I can have a tiny bit of decaf, but I have to make sure it's before noon and I have to make sure I eat something before I have any. But I just, the last few times I tried to drink decaf or coffee just like traumatized me a little bit, but it really like messes up with my sleep too. Like I can't sleep. My sister has issues sleeping and I told her I'm like cut out caffeine because she loves coffee. I'm like cut out that caffeine. I'm like it doesn't matter if I have caffeine that day. I'm like I will struggle sleeping that night or I won't be able to sleep at all. So my sister loves coffee though. Does not whack her out like me but I feel like I feel like if she stopped drinking coffee for a little bit and then she tried to do it again she would realize like it probably low-key whacks her out a little bit. Drink zero co- oh. I wanted the powder in here. Do you watch WWE? Rose? I don't know who that is. I drink coffee before I go to bed. Oh my gosh. See, my husband could do the same thing. He could drink coffee before bed and be completely fine. And then there's people like me that can barely handle coffee at all. <laughs> So interesting, right? I have so much coffee at my house that's just sitting here that nobody's drinking. I need to drop some off at my, maybe I should, I might go to my parents' house today. Maybe I should bring them the coffee that we'll never drink. You make putting on makeup so easy. I never seem to get a nice foundation coverage. I have lots of freckles. Um, If you do the serum foundation, uh, if you do this foundation and you shake it up really good and then if you use this kabuki brush you should be able to cover your freckles but you want to stipple it on like this you don't want to blend blending will blend out the coverage if you want more coverage from your foundation whatever foundation you're using even if it's a powder you want to stipple it on because you're packing layers on versus like blending is just blending out some of the coverage so if you're trying to get like the fullest coverage possible, you want a full coverage foundation and you want to stipple it on like this and just tap it on instead of blending it out. Because when you blend, you're making it more sheer. So it's a good little tip for you. I I drink coffee before bed. I, it does the complete opposite for me. That's so funny. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know what why some people can handle it and why some people can't handle it. It doesn't really make a whole lot of sense to me, to be honest. All my freckles have come out because of the sun. Oh, I can imagine. The sun always makes all the freckles come out, right? All right, let's do this bronzer. My necklace is from Bombshell Beads. If you comment hashtag beads on Facebook, it will send you a link to the website. If you're on TikTok, it's linked in my bio with my discount code. But now we're doing bronzer. This is medium bronzer. I'm so excited for these wigs though. I actually might wear one today. With wigs, see, I don't really know how to trim wigs to make them look more realistic because you gotta like cut the, the mesh where the wig is to make it look real and I'm really bad at cutting them. So if I wear wigs, I like have to wear a hat with them. Today is 32 out so far, so it could be hat weather. I might have to wear one today. Run. And then I'm gonna just blend this out with a big, big fluffy brush. How do you not get powder in your hair? Oh, I get powder in my hair. For sure. I'm not that careful. Nerves. You can drink soda right before bed and it doesn't bother me. You can go right to sleep. That's crazy. Yeah, I can't. I 
can't deal. Brought Chanel earrings with your code for Xmas and I love them. Aren't they the cutest things ever? I have an order coming this week from them and I'll have some new pieces to show you. But they, she has like the cutest earrings ever. This is from her website as well. These are Dior earrings. Oh, there's a burp. These are Dior earrings from her website, but I have a couple new ones. I have some Louis Vuitton ones. I think I picked out some Chanel ones. I don't remember all what I ordered. I don't remember. But I have a couple new ones on the way, so. Excited. But, yeah, I love her pieces. They're just super cute and chic looking and they just kind of go with anything. Anything and everything. I'm just kind of blending some of this out with my Kabuki brush. I always put too much bronzer on my nose, so I always have to lighten it up a little bit because I go a little crazy with it. The birds are doing good. They were taking a steam shower today with me. Um, we're using the Pocket Palette Pink for blush today. This beautiful color right here. I think this will be pretty with that green. And then we'll just use the luminizer out of here too since it's right here. We'll use this for our loom. Oh, so shiny. Right there. Right here underneath the brows and then now it's time for eyebrows because our base makeup is done i love your corvette shirt color looks very pretty on you thank you that's why i bought the shirt actually because of the color because i really liked the blue color sometimes that's the only reason i buy an item even if it doesn't fit i almost didn't buy it but i was like the color looks really good with my skin tone so i'll buy it You have two macaws? Oh my gosh. Are they loud? You sent me pictures? Yay! I'll have to look. You got to swim with dolphins. I'm a little jealous. I would like to swim with dolphins at least once in my life, I think. All right, brow pencil in medium. That's what I'm using today. Um, that is luminizer or eyeshadow. It's either one. So that little palette I just showed you if you have not, if you do not have one of these little pocket palettes, they're awesome. You should buy one. <laughs> Peer pressure. If you get one, get this one. This one is so pretty. This one's called, this is on my website, by the way. This is called Berry Bisque. But what it is, is it's like a mini little palette that has a bunch of different colors in it. So it'll have your lip color, your blush color, um, your eyeshadow, and then your luminizer color. So it has a little bit of everything. So it's, this is the luminizing color, so you can use this as luminizer and you can use it as eyeshadow. Then you have this color. This can be used as a blush or an eyeshadow. This color can be used as a blush or an eyeshadow. And then the last color is the lip color. It's like a lip gloss. So it's like a little mini palette with a bunch of little colors in it. And then it's got a little mirror in here. They're called pocket palettes because you could literally put this in your pocket. They're awesome. But this one is my favorite. It's called Berry Bisque. It's very pretty. It's very pretty. I really like that pink color. I've been using it as a blush a lot lately. Just bought a few things now. What did you buy? You buy makeup or jewelry? This also, this ring is from Lavish as well from the same website. I think I, that, I think I actually ordered that brown ring if I remember correctly. I don't remember. Oh, that's so funny you just said that, Ashley. <laughs> yeah, the ring is from Lavish as well. So if you're on TikTok, the link's in my bio. But if you're on Facebook, you can just comment hashtag Lavish and it will send you a link where you can find the earrings and the ring. No, everything is more um, everything's limited supply because these are all handmade pieces. 
so it's not like a big corporate website where they can just keep making the same thing all the time she has to source out these pieces so she might only have like a couple of each so just keep that in mind so i don't know if there's what i don't i think she actually did get a restock of this ring but i could be wrong but i think there's only one of them so just keep that in mind i think there is a restock of this ring unless it re it's sold already right you know what's crazy though i had like all my um the other day i had all my diamond jewelry on my fancy pieces and the girl's like oh i like your ring and then i was like oh thank you i thought she was talking about like my wedding ring or something you know big bling and she's like, no, that one. And she literally pointed at this one. She liked this one out of all of my jewelry pieces. This is the only one that didn't have diamonds on it. She liked this one out of all of them. I was like, oh, thanks. <laughs> How funny. <sighs> but, yeah. Okay. What was that? I even, my birds heard it. You hear them squawking in the background? Oh. Amazon. I don't remember if I ordered anything from Amazon. Yeah, this shirt looks really nice. Aren't these earrings cute though? They're like, they're studs. So, you know, studs are usually more casual, but I like that she has studs like this that are blingy. So it's like a blingy earring, but it's without all the like dangly stuff. Let me go get the mail. I'm back. Gosh. Okay. We're almost done with makeup and then with wig time. Describe my wedding ring if you can. It's um it's radiant cut, which is my favorite. Radiant cut is like one of the most sparkly cuts you can get. That was my thing. I wanted something sparkly because I like sparkly things. So like no matter what cut you get, if you get a round or a square, if you want something really sparkly, tell them to do radiant cut. My ring was custom made, so I like custom designed how I wanted it to look. But radiant cut, and then it's a, I think it's called a pillow cut. So it's like the shape of a pillow, like a hexagon, but not as long as a hexagon, but not as square as a, as a square. Does that make sense? So it's like the shape of a pillow. And then it has a halo around it. So it's got a bunch of little diamonds that go around the larger diamond. And then it's got diamonds that go down the band halfway. They don't go all the way around, they just go halfway. So that's what my wedding ring looks like. But, um, all right. Did we finish my brows? We did finish my brows, kind of. Um, I can show you after my live when I have my makeup done. I don't really wear my rings when I do my makeup because then they get all dirty. So I don't like to wear my diamond jewelry until like after I have my makeup done just so they stay cleaner. Like I don't wear them in the shower. I'm like very picky when I wear my diamond stuff. Um, okay. Uh, okay, yes, that's what we're doing. We're doing, <laughs> we're doing this palette. I am getting more energy though. I'm just, um, my throat is annoying. Um, hello from Holland. Okay, so we're doing Jealous, which is this brown color right here. And then we're doing, uh, Inconceivable which is the green. 
Okay. So we're going to, this is the, I'm using the fluffy crease brush. So we're going to pop this in the outer corner and then the green's going to go on the lid. We're not matching my eye makeup to my shirt today. I am drinking the greens. The greens. They don't taste like greens though. They taste, it tastes like a tropical drink. To me, it tastes like a mocktail. Like if you got a mocktail made, that's what it kind of tastes like. Tastes like a tropical mocktail. They're really good. If you don't like the taste of greens and vegetables, those greens are really good. I take, I take their greens, the same company. I take their greens, their probiotic. I take pretty much everything. The only thing I don't take from them is the trim fit because it has caffeine in it, which really sucks because I really like the grape flavor of the trim fit. The trim, the trim fit grape flavor is so yummy. Like I could drink that all day. It tastes so good, but I don't really, I can have a little bit of it, but I don't really drink it that much just because of the caffeine in it. The greens taste so good, don't they? They're just, they're just so yummy. Okay. Same color underneath the lower lash line. And then we're going to grab a flatter brush. This is the liner slash shade brush, I think it's called. And we're going to grab inconceivable and we're going to pop that on the lid here, like so. Bada bing, bada boom. That looks very nice. I thought I didn't have this green color, but I actually do have this green color. It's just in my big palette. Yes, I'll show you in a second. I'll show you again. I'll show you for the fifth time. But I have to do this first and then I'm gonna do a white shade we're gonna do palette we're just gonna do the cool tone palette I'm gonna use the white color out of here for the inner corner of the eye um and then I'll show you the palette we're almost done with our makeup and then wig time this is the palette so this is a custom palette you can make can make this same palette if you want to. This is a palette that I built by myself. So this is Jealous, um, Visionary, Covacious, and then this last one is called Inconceivable. So the two colors I use today are Inconceivable and Jealous. Jealous. This Jealous color is really pretty on the eyes. It's like a bronzy, it's like a bronzy color. All right, love this hack. This is a super nice little hack. If you like the look of wings or you just like the look of a cleaner eye, you just grab your little um, splurge cream brush here and you do a little swipe a -roo, like so. And then you just tap it out. And that just creates this nice little lifted eye look slash wing. Hi Nikki, what's poppin'? What's poppin'? Gosh, I just, any, I'm curious, does anybody else have like really prominent red veins in their eyes? I have like such big red, well I just have like one really big, big red vein in this eye, like can you guys see it? You see that big red vein? I've had that in my eye forever. Does anybody else have like red veins in their eyes? I think that tends to make my eyes look more red when they're not, but it's just been there forever. And it's just like such a big red vein. My eyes aren't dry. They're not dry. It's, it's I've literally had it forever. It's always been there. I wonder if it's like a genetic thing. I don't know. 
Um, oh, we should turn the splash curler on before I do that. Um, thank you, Patricia. I do not wear contacts, no. I don't really, I don't put anything in my eyes. It's just my natural eyes. Got very blue eyes, but then I got, I have like veins. They're, they're not like on the bottom. They're like always on the side of my eyes where it's visible. I have one on the other side too, but it's not as red as this one is. It's very red. Um, okay, lash curler. I already have mascara on, so I'm just gonna do one little quick coat of mascara and one quick little curl. This is that heated lash curler that we love so much. I haven't even touched my other lash curler since. You have the same thing? Okay, so I'm not the only one. Right, we must be the only ones because nobody else commented and said they had red on their eyes like that. Red veins in their eyes. Um, I actually read something about it too. Where like, it's it's actually, I got eye reading done. But like different parts of your eye signal different things. And I think when your veins point to a certain sp spot in your eye, I have to look where it's exactly pointing but it usually points to an organ or something in your body that's like struggling. So I should look up my, you can look up, I think it's called like an iris chart or something like that. And wherever that vein is pointing towards, I think that's what it means. Are you worried the heat will damage your lashes? No, it's not very hot. It's not very hot. It's not like a curling iron hot. You know what I mean? It's just like a little warm. Uh, no, I go tanning once in a while and then I use tanning drops on my face to keep my face as tan as the rest of my body. My face still isn't even as tan as the rest of my body. My, other, my body's pretty tan right now. Hi from North Carolina. Okay, lips and then wig time. So excited. You have red veins, but I have extremely dry eyes. My mom also has this. Could be genetics. Could be genetics. I should see if either one of my parents have red veins in their eyes. Because I never looked. I do think it might be partly genetics, though. The tanning drops are excellent. I know they work really good and they're fast. I like how fast the tanning drops work. Like if I am gonna go somewhere later on in the day, if I put the tanning drops on in the morning, within like three to four hours, I already got a tan. So it's so nice how quick they work. And you can put them under your makeup too, the tanning drops, but you just wanna make sure, I don't know how I did that, the bubble thing. Uh, you just wanna make sure you put it on, I would say like 15 to a half an hour before, 15 minutes to a half an hour before. Um, I'm pretty sure I got a red wig. I don't remember which other ones I got, to be honest with you. I go on these binges where I buy stuff. Like, I don't know. Does anybody else do this? I'll have like shopping binges where I'll just hop from a couple different websites and buy things. And then I'm like, good. I don't know. I have shopping binges. I don't really like shop every day. But then when I feel the need to shop, I'll like shop at multiple places at the same time. So I'll order a bunch of different things from a bunch of different websites the same day and then I forget about it until they come in the mail. So yeah, I see this is why I do not wear gel nail polish. Like it started bubbling already and now I pick it off. This is why I like press on nails so much better. Like that literally lasted two days and it already started bubbling off. I did get the Uggs, yes. Um, I'm trying to figure out what lip color to do. I think we should do brown, but where's the brown? There it is. Cork. Um, I use the hair dryer on my skin to help quick and dry the tanning lotion. Oh, that's smart. You're so smart. 
Um, I use the ones on my website, but I don't know if they're available anymore. Does anybody know if the tanning drops are still available? They were on sale for a while because I think they're trying to update the packaging, so they might be so low for a while. What is the name of the night cream you use, the one you use on your lips? Lips too? Okay, so I use two different ones. So the... The regular one is the Glow Complexion Moisturizer. You can get this on subscription and you'll save a lot of money because um, the first time you get it, you're paying for the whole package. You're paying for this, you're paying for the product. But if you do the subscription, you get the little refill capsules. So this thing actually like pops out. I'm gonna try to do this without making a mess. There we go. This pops out. So that way you're not paying for the whole bin the second time. So the whole glow complexion line, which I use all of the glow complexion, it's three products. It's the anti-aging serum, it's the moisturizer, this is the moisturizer, and then it's the cleanser. I use all three, you can get it in a bundle pack and I do the subscription so that you save and that you're not like having to, you know, pay extra. And you save a lot, like, I think you save like 60 some dollars or something and this will last you forever like this has been when did we drop this we dropped this like midsummer, and i still have a lot left like there's a lot of product in here so it'll last you a long time and you don't have to do monthly subscription you can do it and you can do the subscri subscription for like every four months or every five months or whatever so it's if you're gonna try the glow complexion do the subscription because you'll save a lot more money but I use this, the moisturizer. I do the bundle pack for the glow complexion. I get the, the bundle packs. And then the, the new night hydrating mask, I don't think you can do it on subscription yet, but I hope they'll do it. I can do it. I mean, it looks like it has a thing that pops out at the bottom, so maybe you can. But this isn't part of the glow complexion line. But this is called the overnight hydrating mask. But you can wear this anytime you want so you can wear it during the day whenever this is what i've been using on my face and my lips and it works really good it's very quick like this just like soaks in really fast i'm deciding on which ones to order do you love them the uggs um i got them off amazon i didn't get them off the ugg website because they didn't even have them on the ugg website but they're just like little slip-on ones from amazon and last time i checked they were like almost sold out i do like them though they're very soft very soft uh, okay continue on with lips but actually if you guys comment hashtag hashtag anti-aging i think it sends you the glow complexion as well as the other stuff that i take for anti-aging but i really like that new glow complexion line Very nice. Okay, there's that. We need a lip color. Thinking something neutral. Neutral. I've actually been really, I might use the lip color from the pocket palette again. There you go. Yeah, ha hashtag anti aging if you're on Facebook. Should send you it. I don't remember. I think I have it in there. It should be in there. It's supposed to be in there. But those are the main products. The main skincare products that I use is the Glow Complexion line. I just started using this new blue mask because this is a newer thing that dropped, but I really like it. And then the makeup removing wipes. And that's like the main stuff I use. I use some of their other stuff here and there, like some of the other masks, but like my Holy Grail, Grail products that I use every single day is the Glow Complexion, the makeup, makeup Remover Wipes, and this new blue mask. Those are like everyday things that I use. The Holy Grails. All right, one more, one more product, and then lashes, and then wigs. All right, we're gonna use, this is the lip color that comes in that berry palette that I really like. Wish the trim fit came in individual packets. That would be nice. Like just a little pore packet like the greens do. That would be really nice. 
Um, I think I have the Uggs are, by the way, the Uggs are linked on my Amazon. Uh, Maria, if you do anti-aging, just don't put the, the gap in it. I think it only works without any gaps or dashes in it. So just do anti-aging, no gaps or spaces or dividers. Um, if you do hashtag Amazon, it'll send you a link to my Amazon storefront and they should be linked on there. The Uggs are linked on there. Okay. All right. Lashes and then we are ready for some wigs whatever I ordered. All right. We need our applicator first. Here it is. We need this. I like the trim fit, but made the mistake of taking it in the afternoon. No sleep for me. Oh gosh, yeah. Caffeine. If you're a sensitive caffeine, don't take caffeine <laughs> afternoon. Love your study earnings. Thank you. Hashtag lavish for earrings. All right, we need, I feel like we need some bougie, bougie-ish lashes today. What's your gym routine? Uh, go to the gym five days a week. Um, someday, sometimes I'll skip a day midweek, depends how sore I am. But five days a week, and I do weight training and like 10 minutes of cardio. That's it. Short cardio. Right. I think sassy might look good. Let's do some sassy lashes today. Some sassy. These are the big lashes. Don't turn off on me. Don't be rude. Um, I'm gonna, if you're watching on TikTok, I don't know if they can even see me anymore. Okay. All right, if you're watching on TikTok, I just pinned the lashes that I'm using. They're dramatic lashes, by the way. So if you don't like dramatic styles, this might be a little too bougie, but they do have more natural styles. But these are the magnetic lashes that I use and they're already trimmed. So you just put this lash on the top and then you grab little magnets that click in underneath. I got my lash curler in today and I'm so excited to use it. It's freaking awesome. It works so good. That lash curler, game changer. All right, so then these little magnets just click underneath. So you gotta hold this lash there and then just open up your eyes and the little little magnet just like clicks in. I might have to um, adjust this possibly because I'm trying to do this from a distance here so you guys can see, but you just, oh, I just pulled the other magnet off. My bad. That one's stuck and pulled the other one off. Okay, let's try again. Angle down, click in. Try this again, and then this just goes in underneath here, clicks in, and you just go all the way across the band until all the little magnets are clicked on. We got one left. And then I just go like this to make sure it's on nice and close. Thank you for the fire! The fire emoji, it's, you're still going. Oh my gosh, thank you, we're almost to 20. You're amazing. Oh, thank you. Thank you, Tech Talk. Bam! Do you guys hear the sound in the background? That was awesome. Thank you, Tech. Oh my gosh. My bird's just on and off today, squawking. Oh, bougie. All right, flashes on. Let's put the next one on. And then let's try some wigs on. I'm wearing Dreamy today and a lady thought they were my real lashes. Ooh, that's the best compliment ever. When people think that the falsies are real. That's when you know you have a good style that fits your eye. That fits your eye well. Um, the lashes only ship to the US. So only the US. 
yeah, you just grab these little magnets. And if you buy, by the way, if you buy the lashes, they come with the little magnets. You don't have to buy those separately. They come with them. And they give you extra ones in case you lose any. They give you like four extra ones. But if you trim your lashes like I do, you'll end up with having six extra magnets instead of four. So you get quite a few. I don't know what they could possibly be squawking at. I didn't see anything out there before when I looked. They usually, the birds usually squawk when there's a hawk or something outside. But I didn't see anything out there earlier. Okay, let me look. This one, there's a little bit of a gap, but it's not bad. See, there's a little gap right there. Let me see. Oh, they both got a little bit of a gap, but it's not that bad, so well, that's good enough. I'm just gonna add a little more mascara and then we're going. Yeah, the trim fits for weight loss and for energy. I ordered the beginner's kit, haven't gotten, um, I haven't gotten it yet, but I'm excited. Ooh, I'm excited for you. I have a tutorial specifically for the lash starter kit. It's on this page. If you go under the video section, you'll find it. But that would be a good video to watch if you get the lash starter kit. I'm gonna add one more thing to this look. I think we're gonna add a little bit of white liner in the waterline just to make the eyes look even bigger. I always like to make eyes look big. I just think they're, I don't know. I feel like when your lashes and your eyes look big, it just makes your face look more beautiful. All right, white liner. I'm wearing the color BB cream in medium. Ooh, we could do blue liner because I'm wearing blue. Should we do blue today? I'm gonna put white down first. I mean, that really doesn't match the green, but it'll still look fine. got to make the weird face when you put liner on. All right, let's put blue on. Because I think that would, if I can find it, I might not be able to find it. The white looks really good right now though, too. I found it, this blue. See, it's like the same color as my shirt. Isn't that crazy? Thank you for the rose, Tammy. Thank you. Blue, okay. Yeah, we're gonna do some blue quick. It should be a little lighter because I put the white down first. But it makes my eyes look more blue whenever I wear this. This blue liner is linked on my LTK, by the way. So if you comment hashtag LTK, you'll find it. You just have to click on whatever post has, it's like a makeup post. Anyways, wig time, right? I don't think we need any, do you think we need any blush or anything? I don't think so. Looks good with the shirt. It does, doesn't it? Thank you. We could probably use a little more blush. Maybe just a little bit of purple blush. We'll do a little bit of surreal, this one. I'm pretty sure I ordered a red wig too, so I'm excited. I'm excited to see what red would look like on me. All right, that's better. Let's blend that out. Okay, fabulous. All right, so I'm probably gonna unpin that product now because um, uh, because TikTok gets mad at me if I talk about products that aren't pinned anymore. So if I start talking about wigs, it's gonna yell at me. But if you missed it and you wanted to check out the lashes, they're linked in my bio. So, and there's a discount code there. I don't think there's a discount code on TikTok shop. So if you guys want to get a discount, you could buy it from my website with my code. 
but oh i'm so excited i was excited for wigs i did not see your comment what was your comment jessica um okay so by the way if you're on this is winked winked the the wigs are linked on my website and if you're watching on facebook you can comment hashtag wig or wigs and it'll pop up but we got a couple of them so got to shit you guys know i love my other um printed shirt that i have like this this looks really cute um but we got some wigs i think i got five i got five all right five wigs i don't even remember which ones i got but they come in these cute little packages and we got firestorm hotel i think this is the red one q scent q scent i don't think i'm pronouncing that right but that one new beginnings doja sweet and enchanted so we're gonna open the fire storm hotel firestorm hotel yes this is the red one Ooh, i'm excited i'm excited i'm excited so here's the ooh. look at that color that's exactly the color i want too like uh oh there is earrings in here they come with little earrings how cute they come with little dangly earrings to match your wig um and it comes with your little head cap this is the color i wanted though like uh i'm gonna actually take this off my ring because it's gonna get stuck it's like a copper red that's what i wanted look at how shiny it is Ooh, that's so pretty that's so pretty okay all right so um i think she has this website i think she has like different ones like she'll have fully synthetic half haired half synthetic i don't remember what these are i don't know if these are full synthetic or if they're half synthetic i don't remember exactly but look at this color oh my gosh that is beautiful look at the color we gotta um get a scissors because we gotta this is the part you gotta cut that i'm always bad at cutting the little the little mesh so let me go get a scissors Uh, I went and covered up my birds. Um, if you comment hashtag wig, it'll send you a link. And if you are watching on TikTok, the link is in my bio. Thank you, Ray, for the heart. Thank you so much. All right. So I don't remember how much these all were, but I have a 15% off discount code. So you don't have to pay full price. See, this, this is always hard to cut this because you want to cut it, but you also don't want to cut the hair. I feel like you need to cut these, though, before you put them on. Otherwise, they look weird. So let me just bear with me. Let me trim this up real quick. Cut the little the film off, at least some of it off. Yeah, people are really good at blending these. I don't really know how to blend the the line very well so cut the little mesh off all right cut that off let's put our wig cap on i have a lot of hair to cover up here we got a lot of hair to put in this wig cap I try to, so what I would, what, what, what I try to do, because I have so much hair, is I put it in a bun, and then I try to, like, flatten the bun out in the back, so you don't have, like, a big hump in the back of your head. How do you cut that off? You just cut it with the scissors. You just cut it with the scissors, and you try to cut really close to the hairline. So, yeah, I do this. I do that. Okay. And then you grab the wig cap. Struggling. Okay, then you put the wig, the little 
that part in first. Eh. Why? Why do you cut that? You have to cut it, otherwise it looks stupid. You have to cut it. I'll show you on the next wig that I didn't, I have to cut some other ones. But I'll show you what I mean, why you have to cut it, otherwise it looks weird. Okay. Ugh. Right, so you put that up to your, see, look at the big, I don't know, thing in the back. So then what I do is I try to stretch that little bun out so it's not a big bump on the back of your head. Oh, okay, yeah, I'll show you why you have to cut it. But see that? So then I just try to spread my hair out a little bit so that we don't have such a big, like, you know, thing sticking out. See how much shorter it looks now? <laughs> no, this doesn't look funny right now. This looks so funny. Okay, spread that hair out as much as possible. I think that's probably good enough. I'm so excited. I kind of want to brush this out a little bit quick. Give it a little quick brush. I like these. I like wigs too. It's because they're styled already. So you don't have to like do anything with them. You literally throw them on and they're good to go. Oh, see how pretty it is. Now I brushed it out a little bit. Just kind of makes the curls flow a little bit better. Right. What do you guys think? Do you think red is my color? Or do you think red is not my color? Yeah, and there always will be usually a couple baby hairs in the front and you can decide if you want to trim those or not. But <sighs> yeah, you gotta like, I gotta look up videos how to blend these better because you have to learn how to like blend the front so it looks more realistic. But I'm lazy, so what I do is I just like to wear, I still like, feel like there's a big, well it actually kind of gives me volume though. <laughs> I'm like, I feel like there's a still big boop right there. But I always just like to throw a, a hat on because then you don't have to like blend the front at all i should grab a hat this color is so shiny yeah let me just show you from a distance though the back the hair is so soft but yeah if you are lazy like me you can just throw a hat on so then you don't have to worry about how this looks so that's what i do i just throw a hat on and then you don't have to worry about the the front part of it see isn't that cute yeah this is my hack for wigs is oh see i just got makeup all over my hat um, this is my hat for wigs, or my hack is wearing a hat, so you don't have to do the hairline all pretty. Um, I think this one is a synthetic slash hair mix. I'd have to look again. She has different ones on the website, so you have to see. This color is amazing. Like, look at how shiny it is. That is so pretty. Absolutely stunning color. Yeah, see, it looks so much better now I have a hat on because you can't see the hairline. I have to figure out how to make the, the hairlines look more realistic, but. Oh, do you think this matches the blue shirt today? I kinda, I wanna wear one today, but I don't know which one we should wear yet. Okay, let's look at New Beginnings. Another one. Comes with cute little heart earrings. All right, this is another red one another red one this one looks a little darker Ooh, okay so this is more of like a fire orange this is more of a red but it's got black in it but this one's also so these are a little bit this is like medium length this one i think is a little bit shorter Ooh, that's fun that looks pretty so yeah see this has like the the hairline this in there the mesh you have to cut that but i'll show you what it looks like if you don't cut it vibes yeah, she has so many wigs to pick from so i mean you will get lost on her website she has a bazillion wigs a legit bazillion to pick from you guys are gonna get lost all right so there we goes there goes that but yeah i don't know and you can like i think this is a free part so there's like different types of parts 
I think this one you can part it wherever you want. So you could like flip it around and put it however. I don't even know where I would put this one. Oh, I don't like that. I don't know. I don't know where I would part that. Wow, this color is so pretty. Yeah, I don't know where I'd put that. But there's that one. Beautiful. This one was called Firestorm Hotel. Firestorm Hotel. Wow, the red color is so crazy. I just can't believe how shiny that is. My mind is blown how shiny that is. All right, this is the New Beginnings. So I'll show you what it looks like without cutting this. Without cutting the trim. So see, it's got the little baby hairs. You're going to probably trim all those off, but they give you the option to have those if you want. I usually trim all these little, these little baby pieces and stuff. I usually trim those all off because I don't really like that look. Some people like that look and they like to like comb it down. But see, this is the mesh part you're supposed to trim off. That's why you, you trim that because otherwise it's going to be very obvious that you have a wig on. So I'm going to cut that off quick. And I just use a regular drawer scissors. Um, how do you store them? I just throw them back in the bag and I put them in a bin. I used to have them on a shoe rack that hangs on the, the door. But then I ended up having way too many wigs and I ran out of space. Like literally I have, you don't even want to know how many wigs I have. I have a lot. But... Saved me a lot of money getting my hair done multiple times. And I can literally rewear wigs multiple times over and over and over again. So it's kind of nice. Okay, can't see what I'm cutting anymore. Mm. All right, do we cut the little baby hairs off is what I'm deciding right now. Or just tuck them under. Sometimes you can just, if you don't know if you want to cut them, you can just tuck them underneath the wig and then you don't have to look. All right. Usually I'll just kind of do a general cut on them and then you can make it nicer later on. All right. This is new beginnings. Oh my goodness. Okay. It's like sticking to my shirt. What's going on here? Stop sticking to my shirt. Let me brush this out. There we go getting like staticky on my shirt somehow we got the static how do we get rid of static yeah so like oops. um so like these little these little baby hairs you can actually just tuck them underneath if you don't know if you're gonna cut them yet or not if you're gonna cut them off pew, pew. we've got wild hair everywhere on my face all right tuck this there mm. Oh, this color is really pretty too. It's like a deep red. Oh, what do you guys think of this color? That color is really pretty too. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh, I almost like this color better. Maybe I just like this color better because it looks better with the blue. I think it looks better with the blue. Oh my gosh. Every time I try to do black hair, it makes me look so white. Like it washes my skin out really bad. Um, they have clear containers. Oh, yeah, I usually just throw them back in like the bag that they came in. That usually works pretty good. Mm. Wow. This red one is so cute. I love this color. Oh, see, it's fun too. Like if you don't want to cut your hair, but maybe one day you want short hair, you can have short hair. This is like a short shoulder length one. Actually, it's almost, it's almost a little longer than shoulder, sh it is longer than shoulder length because shoulder, shoulder length would be up here. Oh, okay. So that's a new beginnings. This is super cute too. I think I need like a different shirt or something though. 
I like it, but then it's like, this is so bright and then this is so bright. I feel like you need like a black shirt on with a bright wig. Kind of like when I do my makeup, if I do like a really bright eye, I like to tone down the lip. I feel like if you're gonna have a really colorful wig on, then you have to have like a more subtle shirt on. Um, Q-Scent, Q-Scent, I don't know. I think that's how you pronounce it. I don't know. I got two more. This actually might be a black one. I have a lot of black ones. I just don't wear them that much. All right, this is another red one. Jeez, how many red ones did I order? Ooh, okay, this one is longer. This one's more, I like how these are all different red colors. This one is more of like a natural redhead color. Oh, look at that. Oh, I like the curl on this one. It's like a blowout. Oh, that is pretty. Okay, maybe, maybe this is like the best of both worlds with the two wigs. Let me actually trim it quick. But yeah, this one's more natural. The other one is like hy hyper copper color. This one is like a red. It's not really orange, it's more red. And this one is like a natural redhead color. And it's got a nice little blowout vibe. I don't know, do you guys think I can rock red or orange hair? You think I can rock it? Or do you think it does not suit me? What are your thoughts on the wigs so far? I, I wanna do a wig haul, but literally we would be here all day if I did a wig haul. So I might just do like little mini wig hauls, but like pre-recorded video versions. So I can do them faster. Cause otherwise I'll be here all day. You can rock anything, well thank you. All right, so there's that one. That one is New Beginnings. I should put these back in there so I don't lose them or I don't confuse them I should say because otherwise oh, I don't really like this doesn't really fit in there anymore though maybe I'll leave it out all right look at this one Ooh, this is really pretty I really like the curls on the bottom of this one I like the front too the front is just kind of like my natural hair where I don't really have bangs or anything it's just longer in the front longer bangs kind of thing all right I love them oh thank you beauty Ashley ash ashes beauty ashes I thought it said Ashley for a second oh Ooh, look at this color Okay, so this is a side part one. So see how they all have like different parts? Depending um, what you like, you can get different parts and stuff. You know what I'm saying? So we need to put this up a little bit higher. There's also clips in here, so it'll actually hold and stay on. But oh my goodness, this is like fancy housewives type of wig. This one's like bougie. Ooh. Uh, no. Oh yes. Okay, that's beautiful. Where's my hat? This is like almost too nice to wear a hat with, though. This one. It looks more red than I have it on now. Like it looks like a cross. Well, I guess yeah, redhead. But it looks more like red, red versus orange. Now that we have it on. Oh, this one's cute. I don't know which one's my favorite. Which one do you guys like so far out of all the ones we have done? Which one is your favorite one so far? No, I think this one's my favorite, honestly. It's like the best of like both of those. I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of like a tie between all of them. I kind of like all of them depending like what I'm wearing, you know? I feel like there is a hair somewhere right here got it I really like the um the styling of this one though I like the blowout look that it has like just very subtle natural curls I need a different hat though that doesn't stick up so high like this one I need one that's a little bit flatter but I think this one I like this one because it's a little more subtle so it doesn't like 
my shirt's really popping, so it kind of blends better with my shirt. I think that's why I like this one so far a little bit better. I need to wear a black shirt or something with the other ones, something more safe. Um, You'd have to check the website. I'm not sure if they're safe for heat or not. Uh, the next one's called Enchanted. Enchanted is a pink blonde mixture. You guys already know I love blonde, so throw in some pink. I actually have one that's really similar to this one, but the other one I have is like all pink versus this one's a blend of pink with blonde. It's like really similar to my natural hair color. Like that literally is almost identical to my natural hair color, but then it's a blonde slash pink mixture. This looks really fun. Ooh, I'm excited. Oh, what do you think? We have one more wig after this too. What's the other one? I don't remember. There were so many different ones that I wanted to get. It's just too many to pick from. Did I get a black one? Cause this, isn't a, this is the only one that's in a different packaging. So is this a black one? Cause it's in a black container. The other ones are all in pink containers. Oh, another pink one. This one's like more vibrant. So this is more like washed out blondy kind of thing. Like a, I forgot what pink color, I can't think of it. And then this one, it actually gets, it's black at the top and then it fades lighter and then it's like a bright pink at the bottom. So it's like a dipped pink. You remember the pink one I wore before? I got so many compliments on that other pink one that I have. Oh, this is cute. Look at that one. Let's do this one first because this is fun. So we got these two left. These are the last ones, pink ones. Oh, yes. Cute, cute, cute. Um, we need to name them with multiple personalities. Oh my gosh, that'd be funny. That'd be hilarious. Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. I don't know, I might wear this one today, to be honest. This this one that I have on right now. Let's see the pink. I might like the pink better. We'll see. But I'm kind of digging this red one that I have on right now with the blue. Okay, so we got a little bit of black going on with this one, but it's not completely black, so I should not wash my face out. my light how rude all right turn the light back on wigs yeah hashtag wig if you want to link to the wigs otherwise if you're on tiktok it's linked in my bio yeah i really like this one she is beautiful all right here's the it's like a a little bit longer than shoulder length, but then it's got some waves in it and it's faded. This one looks really fun. Looks like we are ready to party type of wig. We are ready to have a good time in this wig. That's what it looks like. Oh yeah, that pink is so pretty. Oh my gosh, I love the pink. Oh, what do you think of this? This one looks really good with the blue. This one, I think out of all of them, looks the best with the blue. I think this pink with the blue looks like spot on. Oh, look at that. This is fun. I really like this one. What is this one called? Doja Sweet. That's what this one is called. Doja Sweet. Pink, not my favorite. Oh, I like this one. It's fun. Oh my goodness. Okay, let me put the hat on. This is like party time wig it's not as natural because it's a colorful one but it's really fun mm, i think it just looks really good with my makeup today that's you i love it yeah i think it just looks really good with our makeup and the blue like this one matches everything really well wow how cute 
Okay, so there's that one. Let's do the last one. I'm excited for the long pink one. It's, it's like my hair, but with pink in it. So I'm excited to see what this will look like. Since my natural hair doesn't have pink in it, what will it look like with pink in it? All right, this one is good to go. How do I, I need to brush this? Cause it's kind of a mess. Kind of a mess, like my natural hair is always a mess. All right. Lonesome on the lips would match the pink. Oh, that would match really good. Um, No, they're very lightweight. None of the ones I've tried, or none of these that I've tried on are heavy. The only one that I have that's really heavy is a black one and it's really thick and it's really long hair. That's the only like heavy one I have because it's so, it's so like heavy and stuff. I really like the hairline on this one. It looks very natural. I need to like get rid of this boof in the back though. I think the boof doesn't match. Try to figure out how to flatten this down a little bit more. I gotta like spread. Sometimes too what I'll do is I'll put my hair, my bun, like more towards the bottom. So I'm gonna try to stretch this out on the bottom more. So it's not like on the top of my head. Oh, now we got hair coming out the side. I like the second pink one better. This one, you like this, the last pink one? This one's a little more natural. The other one's more colorful. Uh, the black was too harsh against the pink in your opinion. Okay, yeah, not many people like to seem to like the other one that much. Like, oh my gosh, yeah, legit the same color as my natural hair. That's crazy. I love that for me. I love that for me. Oh, what do we think of this? This pink color is really pretty. I can't figure out how to hide my boof, boof better. I don't really want to put my, I don't want to have to redo it though. Not right now anyways. Maybe if I'm going to wear it, I will, but I'll put a hat on so we can see it a little bit better. Ooh. What do we think of this one? This pink color is really pretty. Put my hat on my blending hat. I do have a black wig. I do. Pretty! Do you guys like this one better than the other pink one? This one looks really good with the blue though too. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. You can't even like tell there's blonde in it. Not unless you really look like you can see this looks a little blonde, but the blonde is blended in really nicely with it. It's not like stripey looking. The buffet looks good. I like the house, like the housewife style. Um, do you have a brown in your collection? You can try on so we can see the difference. A brown? I could go see quick. Um, let me go see. Let me see if I can even find my wigs because they're somewhere in my closet. So let me go look. Let's see the back. Oh, fine. Let go look. I found my wig collection. Y'all, these are all my wigs. <sighs> There's a lot in here. I have like 
I'm not going to show you all of them today because we could just have a ball and go through a lot of them. But they used to come, they used to come in these little bags. So I just leave them in these little bags. These little bags are easier. Look at this blue colored one. It's cool. Some of these that I'm about to show you, um, she, I don't know if she has them anymore because I bought them like probably two years ago. So, but she'll probably have similar styles. The ones that I just showed you she has, those are new ones, but some of these old ones, we're gonna throw this on just for the heck of it because I have blue on right now. <laughs> Might as well, this one's really long. Look at how long it is. But we'll just throw this. These are all cut already, so we don't have to cut them. Bam, look at this blue one. Yeah, see, isn't wigs are just so fun. So many things you can do with them. Yeah, this is the blue one that I have. Just go like that. Mm. So fun. Okay. Um, you wanted to see a brown, a brown one. I have this brown one right here. I don't see, I don't know what any of these are called either. So I don't have the names of them, but I'm sure you can find something similar on the website. This is pretty. We'll try this one. Hey, this is a brown. This has like two different colors in it. See how long and thick these, I have a lot of really, really long ones. I like the long haired ones. I kind of switched it up this time because I have a lot of long ones already, so got some shorter ones. This is a brown, very pretty, very long, very thick, thicker. It's not, it's still not very heavy though, considering how long and thick it is. It's really not that heavy. This one has like a, it doesn't really have, this has like a free part. So that means you can like move it wherever you want pretty much, but this is the brown haired one. This one has so much hair. Like, what do you even do with all the hair? I don't even know where to put this, where to put it all. Okay. What do you think of the brown? Oh, I need to like brush it. Looking a little wild. Ugh. You carry brown hair well, thank you. Um, you have wigs too. Um, they are front lace, I'm pretty sure. Front lace. All right, here's the brown. Ooh, this is pretty. See, see what I mean? Like a more neutral color looks better with a bright shirt. See how this brown looks really good with the, look at how long this one is. Cause I have such a bright shirt on. Actually, we could probably stand. I don't really need to sit anymore. Look at how long this is though. Look at all the hair. This is like almost, well, no, my sister's hair is black. I'm like, it's almost like the color of my sister's hair. Beautiful. All right, you wanted to see one more color. What color did you want to see? One more color and then I gotta go. Then I gotta roll. I have a lot of colors in here. I have, I have a mint with black. I have a red, 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 red. I have a purple unicorn uh, one. This is all different colors. I have another pink faded one. This is a long haired one. It's pink on pink. I have a green faded one. I have more red. I have more pink. I have black. I have, I have blue. Got everything. I got literally any color you can think of. 
black unicorn, mint, black. I got two blacks. Everyone wants to see me with black hair. Black. Is this a black haired one? Is this like a, uh, is this black? This is black. Here's a black one. And there's still a hair clip in it, that's funny. All right, y'all wanna see me with black hair. You wanna see if it really washes my face out. Look at how long, this one is super long. Like this is almost, this is like half my height. I'm five, five foot one inch. So this is like, what is this? Three inches or three feet? That's like three feet right there almost. Oh, but it's pretty. Okay. Try the black one on quick. And then I gotta roll. Ooh. Yeah. The only thing about the long haired ones is they kind of get in the way. So you have to remember that. Like when they're really long like this, like when you're trying to put a jacket on and stuff, they get kind of annoying because they're super long, but they're pretty. They're kind of better to wear in summertime, I feel, like the long ones. So you don't have to deal with like a coat and stuff. But they're still doable. They're just going to look exactly like your sister. Maybe. This one has a side part. So you can wear it on the side like this. You can wear it a little bit up. Sorry, I'm having a hard time seeing where the, the part is. Oh my gosh. I got... There we go. All right, I don't know if we should do side part or middle part with this one. Mm. All right, there's black. It's getting caught in my nails. For those of you who want to see me with black hair, now look at how long that is. Crazy. Put my hat on. My blending hat. All right, that's with black hair. I don't know. I like I like the black, but I don't think it suits me. I feel like my sister can pull off dark hair, but I don't feel like I can pull off. I can pull it off a little more now because I'm a little tanner. But when I'm white, like white, white, then I don't think I like it. Yeah, not the most flattering on me. Exactly. I don't think I do well. I have like a warm skin tone and I think you need a more cool skin tone to rock darker hair colors. And I don't really have that skin tone, so. But here's black. What time is it? All right, I'm gonna try one more on just cause it's fun. By the way, if you wanna check out the wigs, they're linked in my bio on TikTok or if you're watching on Instagram or Facebook, you can comment hashtag wigs. It'll send you a link with a discount code. Um, let's do... Let's do a purple one. Purple would be kind of fun. The unicorn! The unicorn one's cool, but I don't think they have that one anymore. Here's a purple one. It's like purple with light purple. And like it has red in it too. You can't see the red, but it has little bitty accent red pieces. What we got going on here? Those baby hairs, what is that? Oh, so crazy baby hairs or something. Hashtag red number three, lighter pink and brown are your favorites. This, this purple is really pretty. This purple is very pretty. Purple always looks good on me though, so I like, tend to like purples. I like purple makeup a lot, so. <laughs> thank you <gasps> love the purple i know the purple is really pretty that's why i had to try it on again the purple is a stunning stunning darling stunning but yeah if you want to check out the wigs they are linked in my my bio on tiktok and so is my lashes and my earrings and my necklace and my ring that i took off and if you're watching on facebook Hashtag lavish for the earrings or the ring. 
hashtag beads for the necklace, hashtag lash for the lashes, or hashtag wig for the wigs. Um, otherwise, when in doubt, just go to my website, beautybyhannalee.com. Everything's linked there with all the discount codes. I have discount codes for pretty much all of the items. Pretty much all of them. With purple tip lashes, that'd be so pretty. I need to get some new purple tip ones because I don't have any left, but that would look really good with purple tip. All right, we gotta go back to my natural blonde now. My room looks like a disaster. Oh, we forgot to put on that, that top. The top, I feel like I got something in my eyeball. I don't know what that was. All right. <laughs> my hair feels so like weird now. The wigs are so soft, my hair doesn't well, I guess it does feel soft. It feels better now that I brushed it out. At first, my hair felt so weird. Felt like matted down. All right, natural hair. Natural blonde for the win. I was just born to be a blonde. I was born to be a blonde. Okay, phew. Um, how do I open this? One more. There we go. I forgot about this. The blonde, though. How much for that? Oh my gosh, it's funny. The blonde. Okay. This, um, the girl that sells the wigs, she sells a bunch of stuff. So there's a bunch of other stuff on her website. She has clothing. But, oh, this is so cute. We might have to wear this today instead of what I'm wearing right now. Oh, this is so cute. Uh, hand wash. Okay. It's super soft. I wanted to see what it was made out of. I feel like I'm gonna need to take my other shirt off. But, wow, I love this. Oh, this is so cute. I love it. It's shorter. It's like a... It's like a crop top top type deal. So it comes up to like here. Let me just do this so you don't see the rest of that. Oh, this is so cute. This looks, oh my gosh, this is adorable. This looks like the other top that I have that I really like. Ooh, I wonder if she has more like this because I really like that top I have. I might need some other colors in this. This is so cute. Oh, this is from the wig website. If you do hashtag wigs, it's from the same website. Wow. That is so cute. Wow, I really like this. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Um, okay, I'm going to roll. I got to go. But I'll see you guys later. Beautybyhannalee.com. And thank you for sending me the gifts on TikTok. And um, I'll see you guys later. This is a medium. This size is a medium, and it's, like, perfect. It's perfect size for me. So I'm assuming these sizes run a little small, right? Yeah. So this is a medium. It's got pockets too. Yeah, this is so cute. This like matches my outfit so nice. I'm going to wear this instead of the blue shirt because this matches better. But okay, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye.